Okay, I'm gonna talk to you about this bike here. It's called the Primo. The light there. It's a very interesting bike. Very expensive bike. I was really wanting to fall in love with this bicycle or tricycle. Call it. It's got a front, two wheels to sprint into it. Again, I got this from a local bike shop, which uh, I never knew anything about it. This is a Dutch built bicycle or a German built, one or the other. It's very European design. If you're gonna drive this slow on a flat ground, it's a great, it's a great bike. Anytime you have to do a sharp turn, not the best, but I'll get into that. The appointments I like, lockable brakes. So you can lock it if you have passengers on it, like children. Same thing here, this locks the front brakes. So here's your front brake. This is the back brake, okay? Very well built very well designed um so the pluses are quality unbelievable okay i mean really good quality as far as things go safety features really good it's a seven speed it's got drum brakes i have to say you know i wanted to move something up i wanted to get something really nice a nice quality bicycle or something to get me out riding you know, this I've just taken two miles just to test it out on a local track. Now this is again, this is in America. So European cycling is a lot different than American cycling. I assume this to be more of a European style cruiser. It is a seven speed, but I have yet to reach that seven speed when I had it out even on the flat surfaces. I have not seen a lot of reviews on this. I don't think I've seen any in English outside of the few people who show up and say okay here's what it does blah 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 but i have to say i love the step i love this this is awesome again i like i really like the front suspension a lot on it and i really was trying my best to just fall in love with this thing because to me it was just gorgeous it was actually a present for my wife but the pluses don't outweigh the minuses so this is just something to look at as a pro as a plus side of it but for me getting into cycling when i have to focus more on the cycling itself it's not worth it there's nothing fun about it it almost threw me off the path it almost threw me off the path when i was riding it and i because if it was an uneven surface so it's a great sloped for a drainage away it caused the bike to kind of want to lean with the dual front tires steering is very touchy you turn it you got two wheels telling you where to go as opposed to like a bicycle where you have one there's no leaning so if you're used to leaning on a bicycle your body wants to lean so it's a whole relearning process on this bad boy again the pluses on this beautiful design Great for people if you have balance issues, unfortunately. Not good for speed, not good for, not good for this, I've got cyclers going by me here. Not really good for, I wouldn't put this thing on like a speed course. This is definitely a cruiser bike. But yeah, anytime you touch the uh, steering on this, it, it turned. You know, and then it doesn't turn again like a bicycle does. It turns with the dual front suspension on it. So you get more response to that. And if you let your hand off the steering at all, like you want to wave to somebody or something and you're not paying attention, it will push you in that direction. It'll let go. So let me stop and do a con video here.